before forming the rootin' tootin' shootin' band of Rough Riders he led to victory during the Spanish-American War. Teddy Roosevelt wasn't the tough guy we know him as today. He was still becoming that man. And up until then, he'd just been honing in on himself. With childhood nicknames like Nancy Boy, Teddy decided early on that he wasn't going to be the butt of every joke for the rest of his life. He picked himself up by the seat of his pants, dusted himself off, and worked harder. By 1897, Roosevelt secured a position as U.S. Navy Secretary. The Spanish-American War began with a boom a year later. The USS Maine had been sent over to Cuba in response to strain building between the countries. Months of silence were interrupted by the explosion of the USS Maine and the instant death of the 262 American troops on board. Although it was ruled an accident, Teddy didn't believe it for one minute, and that did it. Roosevelt immediately resigned his position as Assistant Secretary of the Navy, secured permission to take his own rowdy regiment of cowboys, college athletes, and Texas Rangers to Spain and fight the good fight. Teddy technically wasn't the leader. He let the title of Colonel instead go to his officer friend, Leonard Wood. But his great big personality and quick rise to fame had his team defaulting to him more often than not. During the Battle of San Juan Heights, Teddy rode his massive stallion, Texas, up and down the lines of his men, shielding them as well as he could with his body. He narrowly avoided the bullets raining down on him. But afterward, he would call it the great day of my life. Even though the brief war lasted just two and a half months, the Rough Riders served in two battles and news of their victories spread through the press like wildfire. Teddy's success in the Spanish-American War put him on the public radar, and within two years, he was elected vice president under President William McKinley. He grew from a scrawny kid, bullied for his eyeglasses and weakness, to a hero, a leader, and a Rough Rider. Stay tuned for more on this story, coming up next in the 7K exclusive Miles Standish Design and American Life series, featuring Theodore Roosevelt. An American icon, an American hero, an American life. Only from 7K.